welcome in everybody on this fine Friday. Happy Friday. Do you know what I've got, chat? Do you know what I've got? I've got sound. And I think you might even be able to hear it. Backstory. Yeah. <laughs> Good job reading my shirt. Patch on the cover. That's fantastic. <laughs> No, you're right. You're right. I have a lot of backstory. It's just not relevant to the stream. So it's fine. It's fine. I didn't ask my question very well. Welcome in, everyone, and congratulations, Special and Cobra, on being first today. You get to be the first viewer to redeem first on this fine Friday stream. So you get to be first, Friday first. Pat yourself on the back for that first. And good job for you. And hi, Kate. And hello, Kate Menzel. Thank you for the lurk. <laughs> you know what, Cobra? I am also impressed. Maybe got backstories as, as crit roll merch. And I don't know. I own one red t-shirt and one green t-shirt. So this is Christmas merch as far as I'm concerned. It is the Christmas outfit. We're fine. We're fine. So we've got sound today. Um, how is the balance? Do you guys need it louder? Like, I need it softer. And so I, I'm happy to turn it up differently um but mentally mentally i'm about here and so we shall allow for that to be a little bit boosted for you guys another sailboat do you know what we do have this is fantastic so chat i have clearly if you haven't noticed by the total lack of recognition of what you see here and also by me being a level 12 instead of a level 2 um, I've played a little bit of this uh, since I streamed on Monday because I really am trying to unlock the, the daily puzzle over here in this corner. I still don't have it. Um, but as part of my playing without you guys, I really intentionally wanted to show you guys these because this is the first page. Um, and we have ourselves a smile, which is fantastic, but we also have this. Chat. Let's, let's do this puzzle together. What is this called, chat? This is a light bulb. I think the technology connections YouTuber would have something to say about this. In what world? I know. I know. I know. Um, from my view, a very zoomed in world wherein we are looking only at the filament of the light bulb and a little bit of the base. You'd even accept candle for the white parts. I know. What? In what world is this? A light bulb. <laughs> you see it? It is like the bulb of a plant that does not weigh very much. You know what, Cobra? I think you found it. I think you've got it. In fairness, it does say light bulb, not light bulb. <laughs> I've been having this issue, so chat, I have to admit, I'm a little bit of a phone gamer, those like stupid little games that are just time consuming, um, and I started playing one recently because my brother plays it, and so we can enjoy it together, called Wordscapes, which is one of those classic fill in the crossword from a little circle of letters. It is, it's not an interesting game, but I have opinions about some of the things that it calls words that I go, oh, I see. We just have to assume that hyphens are available anywhere in the word. Anywhere that we want to put them in the word. If there's a hyphen, that word is just a word now. Hyphens don't count. It's fine. It's fine. It also looks kind of like an evil smiley. It does, actually. You do as well you might. We have the Santa Soot Sprite who has joined us today along with Rudolph and a polar bear. They're all from the North Pole. They're visiting us for the month of December. And speaking of 
the month of December, um, we are continuing with our December swaps. So I will start the poll. Um, I'm going to play this game for about 10 minutes while the poll runs and you guys in the meantime, during that time, get to vote on what game you want to watch me play from the selection of game swap games that we've done this year that we didn't finish. So we still have Yoshi's Story, Kirby, Kirby's Epic Yarn, Animal Crossing New Horizons, Papa Louie 3 When Sunday's Attack, or New Pokemon Snap. So we are going to start that poll up. Um, feel free to drop your votes there as to whatever you would like to see me play once I've played this game for a little bit. But I got distracted. I wanted to share y'all like the light bulb with y'all because it's, it's delightful. LI is the element symbol for lithium, so it's a bulb of GHT lithium. Yes. You thought the eyes would have fallen off? Kate Bloomer, I treat my things with respect. I have been very careful with my soot sprites. They are both in perfect condition. But yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm also kind of surprised. Uh, whatever type of glue you used, recommend. Definitely recommend. So we're going to go back to what we were doing, which is uh, playing through... We now have 10 by 10s instead of 5 by 5s because uh, I've gotten that far. And we also have the ability, and this is fantastic, we can now cycle around the edge. Uh, we don't have to just like reset. And I am brilliantly, as I said I would, I am playing with the keyboard now instead of with the mouse, which is just so much better. I just would highly recommend it. Shoutouts to your hat for punctuating perfect with the jingle bell. Yes. Milepost is really vague. I think it's like a signpost and it's going to have signs going in two directions. Uh, but, you know, I still have to prove that. That's interesting. If I had to guess... I would say we're looking at that. Yeah. We are looking at uh, this. This is a milepost. But I would suggest that often the titles of these aren't helpful. Not at all. What did we unlock? Is it money? It is money. I remember money being somewhat important in this game. Only for like buying the upgrades and stuff like that. But really, I just want to unlock the daily puzzle chat. Maybe December will just be me trying to do that. It somehow feels as though I need to pay attention now, which is a very new feeling. Okay, so those are the things that are easy to solve. This is a driver. Okay, so I can see the head a little bit, body, and so this is probably the steering wheel over here, I guess. I really want to imagine this as the nose and this is like the edge of the hair. You know what I mean? I think that's that's fantastic. Huh. Interesting. One, two, three, four, five, a two. Okay, so the steering wheel is just uh, very vertical. That's, that's fine. That's fine. It's, it's a driver, right? It looks like the guy from the Jetsons to me. That's what I feel like I'm looking at with this guy is the guy from the Jetsons. Ooh, church. Still more believable than the sailboat. Yes. 
Oh, I need to know which side these start on. These ones. Cool. They start on that side, I think. It does kind of look like George, and he is a driver! That is how that has to go. Uh... Okay. Oh, right. Okay. Okay. So there's going to be steeple over here. I see it now. I did not understand what they were going for with church, but honestly... As basic pixel art, not bad. I've seen worse. There, it even has like flying buttresses on this side. Ish. I know! I know! There have been a couple. So this heart, oops. This heart is also pretty good. Like it's very clearly a heart and it was done on a five by five. And so like, I think they did about as good a job as they could. The anchor was pretty solid. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. There's a lot of these that you gotta squint at, I think. The mushroom and the spade look very similar. We've got a melon. Um, but what did we unlock? What did we get? We got something. The architect unlocks more stages. Okay. I can't afford it though, so that's fine. Why is the spade not centered? It's because you can't center it on a 10 by 10 when you're doing it at this uh, level. So there is one blank column on the end and you can't scale it up without adding more spaces. Like you just don't have half squares. It's, it's an inherent problem. There's gonna be a lot of uneven ones as a result. Uh, as well, it should bother you. It, it is very much an excuse. I'm really worried about this melon. The melon is also not centered. Kate, look away. And also is going to be weird. Bend space and time to create extra room. I know. It's very simple. I don't know what I'm going for here. Probably making some kind of spherical thing. I mean, I'm going for melon, but what does that even mean? Okay, so it's a melon with a them maybe in that case finish off the circle speaking of bending space and time what on earth is this monstrosity it looks a bit like a grenade actually I can see it as a melon that's a honeydew Okay. So the tea that I have today, chat, um, is a salted caramel oolong, and it's surprisingly good. It looks like a Japanese depiction of a perfect melon. Yes. Stem is wonky. You know what? That it it's you can only go so far with perfection. Oh, I need to unlock running. My gosh. So there's a point in this game at which you unlock the ability to just press and hold a button and like your cursor runs. 
but I do not have it. So each one of these movements involves a key press, which gratefully you can actually see. I really look forward to unlocking running. What if it had been a square watermelon? You know what? That's a thing we allow. Well, that's cool that they just gave me that. Graduation cap though. Oh, that's the tassel. All right, all right, all right. If that's the tassel. What is this? Guys, you can't tie. Okay, I'm gonna have to make a decision here. Um, we're gonna finish this page and then I will flip a coin to decide between Kirby's Epic Yarn and Papa Louie 3. You forgot to vote. Okay, Petulant Cobra, do you have an opinion between Kirby's Epic Yarn and Papa Louie 3 when Sunday's attack? Feel free to flip a coin if you need to. So, like, I could stop here and call it a graduation cap, but there's so much more happening. This, this is now looking more like a teapot, kind of? Oh, it's on a head. <laughs> gotcha. I see the Lego face now. <laughs> it's, it's on a head. Whoopsies. You vote for Kirby? Okay. Okay, we will go back to Kirby's epic yarn today then. And look, we're even at the end of a page. That is the weirdest graduation cap. Okay, that's XP. That's fine. That's fine. We're fine. Everything is fine, chat. I don't know why you think it's not. How am I doing this one again? I think I'm doing it like this. Oh. So I'm gonna have to make another transition. Oops. This is gonna be fun. Uh, bear with me for a moment. Well, we pop over to here, where it's probably completely silent for you. Because I have things that need to be changed. At least I think so. What what mess? What what have I done? Oh, I I know what I've done. I know what I've done. Talk amongst yourselves for a minute. Everything is just frozen and bad. Uh this. I need to uh, close that, and this I need to close. That's fine. Okay. Hello? I think I left Kirby's Epic Yarn on my shelf chat. So it's gonna take me a minute. I'm gonna have to go get it. Which is weird, because I'm usually so good at remembering things like that. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Y'all are gonna have to behave yourselves. Can you do that? Are you are you capable? Oh my gosh, I've managed to mess up my entire computer. <laughs> this is fantastic and I love it. <laughs> I do not trust the fiend chaos at all. We're going to do Kirby's Epic Yarn 2.0. Kirby, 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 Kirby's. Oh my, there's a lot of Kirby actually. There it is, Kirby's Epic Yarn. We will change our identity. Okay, enjoy your chaos very briefly. And the absolute silence. I'm gonna, I'm just, I'm just gonna move some things. Just gonna do a little shift. Nice to see you, Fal. Welcome and thank you very much for the lurk. I hope you're having a good work day. I'm switching games right now, so.
<sighs> Did you behave, chat? Or were you being deviant? Okay. Ta-da! It's an epic game, it says so. Okay. Oh my gosh, no. I think my batteries are dead. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get new batteries. Ah! <laughs> I solved um, the problem that I had with the sound. Only to only to have new problems today. <laughs> so many problems. Okay, okay, okay. Again, be behave yourselves. Behave yourselves. I will be right back. Wasn't it low the last time with Kirby 2? That is probably true. It's like, I have to use a Wiimote to play Kirby's Epic Yarn. Um, and so that makes sense. Because they're probably very old batteries. Okay, be good. Danta is literally watching you. Be good. I'll be back. It was doing, it was doing the flashing. Why aren't you connecting? Hello? This is the one I have over here. Oh my gosh. Now I need something pointy. Pointy. Ooh, that might work. Let's try this. Okay, Menzel, welcome back. I am struggling. I am having such struggles. Where did all of our batteries go? I had to poach too, because I can't find them. If only we had scissors everywhere in the apartment, but they're not right here, Kay Menzel. We know he's been naughty. We'll put him on ice. You better watch out. You better not shout when we're telling you. Venom claws. Yes. Yes. Absolutely. Oh, they're double A's. I so I found two. Are the bad all the batteries are in various dongles but i thought we had like a box of them in the tool drawer and i do not see it anymore which is super weird in my opinion did that work 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 yes amazing chat it's working okay i'm gonna do this Maybe you moved it to the cloth mask drawer. That would make sense. I could I could see that as being a logical choice. I just didn't have time to look. Because, ow, I punched things. We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> we're, we're getting there, chat. We are getting there. We are getting there with a fake Wii menu. Which means... Ha 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 ha! Y'all can come with me. Look at that! I'm so set up. I am not. I am not. That's fine. Just takes me a minute. Venom Claws! Thank you, Kate Bloomer, for redeeming word of the stream. Hold on. <laughs> 
Amazing. That was adorable. Oh, you did move them? Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. I was like, there's no way we've used like 50 batteries since I last needed batteries. You know? It's fine, Chad. I found batteries anyway. Despite Kimenzel's best efforts to make sure I couldn't, I found them. Okay. Venom Claus is coming to town. Venom Claws. It's not the neatest work that I've ever done, but it's good. Um, there were... There were two left in a partially open package in the bottom drawer, and so I snatched them. Venom claws! I didn't take them out of another Wiimote, but I was gonna. Venom claws. Rudolph, your ears are really in the way right now. That's fine. This is visible. This is fine. He sings that he's coming to town when he's already in town. That's funny. Butter Buttons, welcome in. Thank you for redeeming third. Lovely to see you. Let's do one player. <laughs> all of the noises already make me happy. Are they working? Yeah, they are. Okay, what am I doing again? What even is this game? This is a yawning dinosaur. Can I jump on him? <gasps> I can! Chad, have we been to Dino Jungle? How do I know? Have we been to the boss here? Okay, so lava landing we finished because there's a thing. Okay, so we have not been to Dino Jungle, so that's where we're at in terms of levels. Do I remember how to play this game? No. Does that matter? Not really. So we're gonna keep going. We've got Dino Jungle. I love the dinosaurs. Oh! I do have something exciting, chat. This is super awesome news. Um, and I will share it at the end of this level. Do you remember how to play any game? I don't know, Kim Menzel. It's been so long since you've tried. You like excitement? That's amazing. I too like excitement. Petula Cobra. Okay. He can be a car. Oh my goodness. Wait, I can... I could just put that down? Do you have a meeting in 90 seconds? Fine, fine. I'll give you a hint. I have a 3DS with capture card capability now, so I can actually stream DS and 3DS games. Oh, UK Bloomer. We got it from a person in the UK who does soldering and capture card installation and we ordered it a year ago. Do not follow this process. <laughs> Best not to ask. We could have played this in worse quality. Amazing. So the reason that I'm excited about that, I mean, other than the obvious, hello? This is so cute. Other than the obvious excitement of just having it, is the fact that this means I can play games like Sticker Star! We finally got a capture card 3DS after so much work. Yeah, but this is so easy. Uh, uh, uh buttons questionable. I do not understand the technology. Please refer all questions to K Menzel. So, there's definitely a thing this way that I just ignored for no good purpose. Okay, that is the edge. So, this purple dinosaur is gonna have to help us again, which I'm sure this purple dinosaur is fine with. They seem, like, really helpful. And then we've got, like, a floating thing. Can I go this way? Which I assume... Yes. Amazing. 
I am a huge fan of this level. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, he moves. This is fine. Thank you, my dude. Thank you for the ride, Mr. Sushi Head. And we're Miss, Mrs. Sushi Head. You're, you're allowed. You're allowed. Yeah, so... I don't know how it works, but there's like a thing that you can add into the body of the 3DS that involves like rewiring it and somewhat to actually let it function as its own capture device. Thank you, Kmenzo, for explaining. Oh, I swear. Oh no! That. Oh no! Evil bees! Okay, we avoided all the evil bees. We succeeded. Those are all words. Suffice to say, we found someone who was willing to sell us a DS with it already onboarded for probably less than the price that it would take to get just a DS now, much less all of these things. So I'm really excited about it because we ordered it last year and we knew it was gonna be a long wait. Um, and it was a longer wait than expected, so don't recommend. But we did eventually get it, and so now this allows me to open up so much more of my library in terms of games that are relatively easy for me to play and stream, um, just because I have, like, I owned handhelds long before I owned consoles, so I have so many Game Boy games, GBA, and like DS and 3DS games, and I'm super excited for that. And I really wanted to have this before I streamed like the Zelda franchise or the Pokemon franchise, because this just lets me do it in a way that I enjoy. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it is not, it is not simple. It is. <clears throat> nope. Uh oh. Well, we're here now. Oh, he came back. That's so nice of this. Uh, this dinosaur came back. I, I'm, I'm, I'm dodging all the bees with such expertise. But it means that I didn't get everything. Oh, okay. I think I needed that. Oop! Oh. Hello? I would like you please... I am... I am gonna drown. I missed. But very sweetly. My friend, the speedy up and down version of the dino is still here, which is very lovely. Huh. Woo! We got a torch. Oh my gosh. This is now Flappy Bird. <laughs> Amazing. Think of all the 3DS games that I can play now. I know. Okay, but I don't have Kirby's Epic Yarn and Yoshi's Crafted World on 3DS. I have Kirby's Epic Yarn on me and Yoshi's Crafted World on Switch. 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 But but you're right. I haven't played I haven't played them on 3DS. Ooh, what is that little snail? There is like a snail friend. Whoop. I am, I am moving past the optimal point. Scarlet Grove, welcome in, Super Paper Curvio, or a Yarny King. <laughs> yes. Okay, so the snails are enemies. They count as enemies. That is, that is good to know. You're missing the point. You're right. I don't know what that guy was going to do to me, but I'm frightened of it. Yes! I'm having a lot of fun collecting all of these gems. This is 
is delightful. Okay, Menzel, don't do it. Don't have the temptation feels yet. We don't need it at this point. Currently. Oh my gosh. Ah! He is made of fire now. Can can I can I even steal him? Ooh. I do want that. This is fun. Y'all have a link to the cellar. Okay, Menzel, do we have that still? Oh cool, I can steal the fire guy, even though he is made of fire. The hand cam is super charming, and I really enjoy it. I am, I am keeping it. I don't even care if, oops, that is not what I meant to do. But you know, it worked. We did a dodge, we did a dodge, friends. Cool. There was more than one route we could take there. How do I how do I get to that treasure? It's it's over here. It's over here, chat. I'm sure of it. Yes. Dino jungle! To get all the way up there? I can do it. I believe in myself, chat. <gasps> oh, yes! Look at this! How cute is that? Very cute. I have decided the answer is very cute. This game has always been very cute. And it continues to be. Oh! Oh, sir. That's a big dino! There is a thing underneath this big dino. I saw it. Oh boy, okay. Where are you gonna go? Oh, thank goodness it's the egg. Toronto slide! Okay, so now. Oh! He's gonna crush me. Yeah, chat! I had the jukes! I dodged all of that. And I didn't even use the card because I somewhat forgot that I had the card as an option. We collected all of that for nothing because I rolled poorly. Yay! <laughs> Garlic Grove, you have a very good memory. It was a long time ago um, that I did that, but I have, uh, I cross stitch, so I do not knit or crochet, but I do cross stitch and quite a while ago. I think it was two summers ago. Um, that was something I was kind of doing in conjunction with a few other things. Yeah, that was when I was way back. I had a totally different background. I was in the whole other room, but I did do that. I made a couple of little pusheen things on stream. Can you do a yarn Kirby cross stitch? That is a great question, Garlic Grove. Um, yes, it feels very easy to do that. I just have to decide on a design because the interesting thing about Yarn Kirby specifically is that his like he's more designed oops by outline and so I would need a dark pink for that but I would need a really really light color to do the inside to actually give it that yarn look um, and so then I would have to decide on like what else is going to go in the pattern but I could absolutely do that that would be a lot of fun. You weren't sure if it was a real memory. That's fair. I get memories like that all the time, but you are right. I have absolutely been cross-stitching, doing knitting and, and like thread cutting and threading needles and stuff on, on camera before on stream, which is very cool. Okay. 
I found the pepper patch, chat. Oh, yay! There's more mini games! Love it. Okay. So, what do I do? I put it there. That's where I want the pepper patch to go. So, that's not something that I noticed before. Oh, this volcano is about to be done. So sorry, sir. I didn't. I didn't mean. I did not mean to, to give you that difficulty. Suggest a commander reward. Yarn Kirby Crossed. <laughs> yes, Scarlet Crow. That's a great suggestion. Kirby Epic Embroidery Thread. Yes. Kirby's Epic Embroidery Thread. So I don't know if I, I don't remember if I noticed this, but there was a little pepper here. And so I think that that is how they're supposed to help me find things. But like, chat, do y'all remember? Do y'all remember? Like, where is this hourglass patch? Where do I get that? Come on. And like, That's not the only thing that I'm missing. I don't do yarn member. Do yarn member? Cause like this is still a question mark. Cause there's a patch, like a little, almost like an oven mitt missing down here. And I don't know how I'm supposed to get those. Okay, that guy's not gonna talk to me. So Zeke said he came over to play. Did he come over? The 21st stitch of September, yes. Okay, so he did come over here. I remember putting my own touch on this room and enjoying it. Okay, and so he came over just to ask if we had time to play. This, well, this is amusing. But I can't talk to him or anything. He's just here. I was wondering if that was a signal that he actually had, like, more. Like, if there was more to do with him? Oh, that, that does seem to be new. Okay, let's see if we can find them. I might not be able to find them. I don't remember Cool Cave. I played it, like, months ago. We have three minutes to find everybody, chat. Ha. This is fine. I'm fine. We found we found one. Oh come on. Sir. The angle. The angle. He's, he's definitely behind that side. Ooh, that was close. I need yarn. That's fine. I see, I see you. How do I get yarn to get over here? Oh, he responds. That's good to know. Because I just kind of threw him. Got him. Got him! Eee. I found all my friends, chat. Oh, and now I have a new one. Okay. Maybe I just didn't do that one last time. Earth yarn and fire salad. <laughs> Screw bandana waddle dee, I guess.
That's true, actually. It did say all my friends, so like, even forget the prince. This one's new? He gives me so many fabrics and I don't know how to use them because I wanted to use this rainbow fabric on something, but I, I don't know how. The fire lizard enemy's name is Candlemander, according to the wiki. <gasps> That's so cute and also definitely stolen from Pokemon. That's amazing. Zeke is the only friend. Zeke is one. Zeke is Penny. Zeke is Legion. <laughs> if Zeke has a million fans, I am one. If Zeke has only one fan, it's me. <laughs> oh, amazing. Okay. Do I know what I'm doing? No. Am I gonna try? Yes. Oh, there's one. Excuse me, Waddle I need to hit that guy. Your grandma's old dog's name was Zeke? Well, that's cute. Interesting. That is a cute name in general, in my opinion, but especially for something like a puppy. I don't think I have to do this to- There he is! Hello, you! So chat, my logic is that I want to try to explore some of the lower area. Oh my gosh. It would really, really help if the car thing, like, was working for me, which it is not. Because I'm not sure if these little guys are going to hide in an area that's like... Well, there's, there's one up here, but I have to get to him from the other side. Oh my gosh, that is the slowest jump. Come on. Oh, okay, and there's one there. So where is the last one? Oh, there he is. Lily Pad! I found him! The theme song for Kirby and the Forgotten Land since it's been brought up. I, so I have not... Do you know what is so funny? I have it, and I bought it, and I was super excited about it, but I wanted to play it with Kay Menzel, and at the time we were playing Lego Star Wars together. Um, and so I waited till we were done with that game, and we just haven't started our next game, so I actually have not played Kirby in the Forgotten Land yet, which feels heartbreaking to me. Only think of Zeke the Plumber. Salute your shorts. Oh my goodness. The theme song is literally just the theme from Perfect Strangers. Oh! That's interesting. Why do I keep having brand new hide and seek to? I mean, I'm fine with this. Hide and seek is very chill. I'm I'm happy. I'm happy to receive more fabric that I can't use. Do you have any Christmas fabric? That would be thematic. Aha! The Dino Jungle. There we go. That makes sense. Cause we did just play Dino Jungle. Your wife is sad to play games with her. That is true. But we have other things. <gasps> Chat, we got the coolest board game! Oh, it's such a good board game. Oh, excuse me, sorry. It is such a cool board game. And and hold on, I am I am doing a time thing right now. Oh wow. Down there. Um It's called oh, Wait, seriously? That's adorable. It's called Mind the Gap, and it is a, a trivia board game that's, like, kind of based around the fact that there's a generation gap, and so not everybody will know the same things. 
And so it has, like, you, you have to answer questions to go around the board, and there's a section of the board that is, like, boomer trivia. There's a section that is millennial trivia. Gotcha. There's a section for um, Gen X and Gen Z trivia. And, oh, and you have to answer a question right in order to roll. Darn it, I missed him. That's, that's going to slow me down a lot. Um, and it is so fun and also so impossible. We both got, oh, I, I need to get him. <laughs> We both got so stuck on some of the boomer stuff last time, especially like headlines and TV and film were like, I, d I don't know, I do not, I do not know. Why can't I just get him from here? Got him. Okay, we're good. Boomers do weird things. Some of them do. We also played it with my mom and my brother and that was super interesting because my mom did know a lot more of that stuff. But oh my gosh, it was just so cool for like learning more. I, I have like strong opinions about what I like about games. Oh cool, I found all my friends. Let's avoid these bees anyway though. I wasn't paying attention, I was talking about a game. But it was a lot of fun and, and we liked it for a few reasons. There's also these bits, so like one of the gimmicks is um, on every, it's, it's like the board is a giant plus shape and each direction of the plus is a different like generation set of like trivia questions. But on each corner of the plus, there's a challenge and the challenge card is basically a version of charades um, where you're either acting or humming or like doing an example of something and it's also generational so there's like generational gaps of types of dances so I ended up having to do thriller for K Menzel last time and thankfully he got it but like sometimes you're just like would you recognize the theme to Spongebob Squarepants if I hummed it? My mom certainly would not. This is, these are the sorts of things that we learned and it's super adorable and a lot of fun in my opinion. If that game is your style, which, like, I can understand why it wouldn't be everyone's style, but it was a lot of fun to play with my family. Oh my gosh, little dinosaur wallpaper! Is that something I can do to the actual wall, maybe? Is, is that, is that what I could do with that? Kirby's Epic Yarn is such a full game. Hold on. Let's, let's look. Right, because I have the cloud wallpaper right now. What were my other options? Nope. Okay, right. Fair. Be mean to my mom. <laughs> I think that this one is the Brontosaurus. Yeah. Oh gosh, that was a that was a reminder and a half. It does look so sad. At least when I was playing the level, I got to pick it up literally by like using the little worry thing to make it lift its head. It is very sad. I don't know where to get these other patches from. Chat, it's astounding. Why am I so bad at this game? Okay, well, we're in Hotland, and we have a boss battle called Hot Wings, which is with a phoenix. Okay, let's see if we can figure this out. 
So what I like about it specifically is that it can be a team game. <clears throat> so when we played it, it was my brother and my mom on one team and me and Kay Menzel on the other team. And it wasn't bad. Oh, well, that's something that I definitely want to throw at you. Oh, okay. We, we are, oh, whoa. Things that I did not know that I was supposed to be aware of. Oh, those are definitely things that I should avoid. Okay. Uh, one presumes I avoid him in this stage. Please, please shoot more enemies. Oh! Okay, he's gonna, he's gonna shoot things at me again? Oh! Two layers! Lowest layer? Oh! That was a dodge! That was a dodge and a half! Oh! More? More fire? No! More fire? Oh no! No, I need them all back! I need them all back! Okay, I have them all back. Oh no! And then I lost them! Shoot, chat, I lost the cycle. Well, I'm getting actively worse at this boss fight the longer it goes on. Oh. Love it. Okay, we did it. Kind of. A little bit. I, so, the things happened. Oh no! Oh no, there are sad stories happening. The neighboring town has an annual gingerbread festival, which includes a competition that we've already missed, and a gingerbread trail, and a life-size gingerbread house. That does sound amazing. We were told it was open Thursdays 5 to 7, and that Santa and a special guest will be there, so we rushed over, and we get there, and it's literally a painted cutout. No Santa, no nothing. Oh, that is tragic. Oh. That is super unfortunate. Oh, I mean, it's like, it's frustrating because if it's a little local thing, you feel like people do know like inherently when they're supposed to go and what they get when they go there. And it feels like you, like when you're coming from out of town, it's like, uh, that really sucks. That sucks. And Fowl, you're right. Kirby was being very rude to the flying fire chicken. I personally would have preferred to adopt the flying fire chicken, but that wasn't an option in this game. That's sad. I wonder if, like, are you going to try again next year is my main question. To see if you can get there in good weather when you know you have the time to see if there's actually something special. <clears throat> oh, buttons, yes. Like to have holiday decorations that just make the outside of a house look like a gingerbread house because yes, you can absolutely get stuff like that in Frankenmuth, Michigan. Sorry, that is a weird thing to know. But like Bronner's Christmas Christmas Wonderland absolutely has like sweets and mints that are like this big that you're supposed to be able to stick on the outside of your house. And yes, heck no, it's literally a piece of painted plywood. Fair, fair. That is not a life-size gingerbread house. 
Yeah, the, the competition sounds like a lot of fun if you bring like a super fancy gingerbread house. Have y'all seen Anne Reardon's How to Cook That when she makes gingerbread just amazing work? I, I, ugh, Cause she does a gingerbread house every year in a video and she did like a mini one in her mini kitchen one year, which was really cute. But she's also done like castles and nativity scenes and just the most astounding stuff. Cause this woman is amazing at cooking and it's so good. It didn't even look that good, to be honest. Well, then you could just knock the competition out of the park and win it. You could just do that. So the hourglass patch. <gasps> oh! We did it. We chat. got the magic yarn. I know where I'm missing the, the magic patch. yarn. Shimmered and spiraled and swirled high into the sky. I earned a patch in that boss battle for getting a bunch of studs and I didn't do that in the first boss fight that's why I'm missing a patch from the first world the yarn weaved its way into the fabric of the kingdom and stitched okay but two that's cake so we're together. definitely moving on instead of going back meanwhile because that is a land made of cake the waddle dees were very busy inside castle ddd let's go hop hop no slacking off barked king ddd just then, the king noticed that one of his waddle dees looked a little... Uh... <laughs> strange. That waddle dee was actually one of Yin Yarn's creations. <laughs> Soon Dreamland will be wrapped around my knitting needles, Yin Yarn cackled. I actually didn't sort notice of plan that there was, was a he difference. Together? What sort of plan was he stringing together? Yes. I've been fighting the yarn waddle dees this whole time. And so I like didn't notice that it was yarn instead of the rest. My, my. It's fine. My observational, my perception roll was low. This is fine. So the hourglass patch goes there and it unlocks a bonus level, one presumes. Oh my gosh, it's from the little pyramid. That's so cute. And so there's a bonus level, patch get. That's very exciting. Okay, I am glad that I learned the solution to that. So this is called Temper Temple. I'm wondering if that lava is gonna like spit the platforms into the air or something. Oh, nope. We are a fire truck. Kindly, kindly remind me how the fire truck works. Yes. Tis a tilt. Love it. Oh no, I dropped some money in the lava. I didn't, I didn't mean to do that. What I'm not good at is timing these to like. Ooh, we got a pyramid chat. Oops, I pressed jump from what I meant to press was shoot water. Oh. Oh, this this guy is that this guy is not being very nice. Not it's not being very nice. But, you know, that's that's fair. I am losing a lot of money. Oh. 
worth it? Possibly. I don't actually know if it was worth it or not. I'm, I'm finding myself having to concentrate so hard for this. Oh my gosh, why is there an upper and a lower one? No! All of my money. So many yarn beasts. There's probably something that I need up here. Oh, there it is. Come on. Oh no. Oh, I see. I see. That was a thing. That wasn't. That wasn't the thing that I thought it was. Okay. But tepid, tepid temple was right there. You're right. Is money not super important in this one? Um. So you have to, like there's stuff to buy and we have to pay. So money is important because of the awfulness of capitalism in this game. We are renting an apartment, which we had to pay money for, from a guy who forces us to pay for his renovations to add new floors to the apartment complex, which we then have to fill with furniture that we find in the world, which unlocks new friends who come to live in the apartment and play mini games with us. So that's why money is important. Tom Nook is in this game. Uh, I think, I think, I think a relative, maybe a cousin. Typical landlord. Yeah, exactly. That was what I was trying to communicate. Was that not clear? Oh my gosh. Yes, I made it. I don't, I don't, I don't, no! We're dying, chat. Oh, we came back to life. But we lost a lot of money doing it. This is fine. I mean, it's fine. I just didn't like. This is not a platform. That's not a place I want to go. Oh, I missed. Oh. No! I'm trying to squirt him! My, my, my squirt gun is not very effective when they're on the same level as me. Aiming down is not a thing that I can do. This is annoying. I didn't get to recoup those ones. I've gone down from like three star to one star in the money. Oh, also it's uh, the, 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 the money is the gems that I'm collecting. And so that was a really bad time to lose them. This is fine. If a man offered you a house with no interest fee and you can pay it back whenever, you take it. It's a very clever game. I love it. He very aggressively lets you pay it back whenever. Yeah, that is a fair definition of Tom Nook. Yay! Silver, not gold. I'm usually much better at collecting, but that's fine. These are supposed to be hard. Red sells you fake paintings and insists that your family, which he overcharges for. It's true. I only got one of the treasures? Where did I not go? And I found the candle patch. So there's, there's, there's more secret levels? Where does the candle patch go? <gasps> There's multiple secret levels if you just get the patch from the boss. Oh my gosh.
That is true, Fowl. Uh, if a fake is that, well, some of the fakes are very easy to spot, but if a fake is hard to spot, that means someone has put a lot of work into it. Wow, red sounds really cool. Okay, so what are Dusk Dunes? Let's see what this is. Let's see what this is about, chat. <clears throat> What do we get to be? These are very gimmicky. Oh, what are my controls again? So one is to accelerate, two is to jump. <coughs> That's a race. We avoid the cactus. Oh, right, we also can't hit. <coughs> We can end on people like that, though. And we have rocket boosts. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, that is the magic carpet. That's cool. Oh, we passed him without the infantry. That was nice of us. Oh, I missed that, though. Oh, and I missed the hourglass. Chad, I missed the hourglass. How awful. Take that. Woo! No! I pressed jump. And he did not. I got the CD. I think that's the guy who's always in first until I pass him. Okay, that wasn't awful. Art is allegedly a great way to launder money. I have heard that. Wow, I only got silver? Okay. Okay, dude. Kirby jumping on the poor travelers on the road? Uh, correct. That's what we do. Okay, so it doesn't do a full circuit. Don't mess with Kirby. I really feel like I should have gotten the hourglass instead of getting the money. But, you know, such is life. Here we are. That's, that's fine. That's fine. Chat, I'm hungry. I'm gonna do a month. Kirby is basically an eldritch horror. You know what? That that seems to be the correct answer to whether or not Kirby's a mob boss. Cool. So is Sonic. Nintendo is particularly good at designing eldritch horrors. Especially in Pokemon. I am entirely in agreement. So. This, this land looked like it had cake. These are toys. Sonic is an ageless being. There's murals of him before his time, we think. He collects items with no known purpose to us, and we have no idea where he stores them. Yep. Meanwhile, Mario's just a plumber. Ooh, I recognize one of the outlines on this. This level has something that I want in it. Oh my gosh, yes. Chat, we can play with the toys. Actually, what we're supposed to do is move it here so that it's a platform for us. But I liked what I was doing better.
just don't trust any of these platforms. This game is so cute, chat. I think I actually want to get on top of that box. No, I missed. instincts except then absolute failure of execution. That's exactly how my gamer instincts usually work. Tow Truck Kirby is the cutest. Yin Yang just wanted to supplement the labor force to offset the global supply chain issues. Who's the real villain here? Honestly, you make a compelling point. Okay, that was one too early. <laughs> Kirby. Kirby's the real villain here, obviously. Have you seen this character eat? So. I need a better jump. Ow. Quit it. I'm done now. here for these platforms. Oh, that is not how I do that. Yeah. Stuffed bear, we got it. He terrorized eight several beings all because someone stole his slice of cake, not even a whole cake, just a slice. Yeah. Gosh, that that one was a feared for its life, and I just, I just, with extreme prejudice, destroyed it anyway. Oh yes, the duck. Okay, I moved it too far. Come back. Thank you. Amazing. These levels are so cute, chat. Oh, we need to not get crushed. Yep, okay, that is literally what I said we needed to avoid. How do we avoid getting crushed here, chat? Because the one comes down before the other one goes up. Oh, there's a door. I am adult. This is fine. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Oh, their noses! Their noses! Look at how cute they are! Oops, I missed. Got a door here. I definitely want this. That was risky, chat. Yay! What does this do? That is not what I was expecting that tag to land on. A tin robot, a very expensive vintage item sought by collectors. Okay. That checks out with my understanding of everything. Oh no, I've been crushed again. I was not fast enough. I misunderstood again which direction I was supposed to care about. Is this a platform? It is a platform. Okay. Okay. 
Oh, I need to go this way. What's here? I've lost so many of my gems in this level, just getting crushed repeatedly because I don't understand where I'm supposed to go. This is fun. How do I get to that? Was it over on this side and I missed it? Yes. Nice. I will take that. Oh! Oh, I see. That was supposed to be the out, not the in. Whoopsies! There is a very cute looking castle that has a door on it over here. How do I get to the cute looking castle though? Nope, he's gonna have to have Who knows? Let's bring this with us. Little, little tow truck Kirby. Oh, I see. I've definitely missed however I get to the cute little castle. How do I get to the cute little castle, chat? Is there a door somewhere on this robot that I'm missing? I hit the wrong one. Maybe I'm not supposed to be able to go there. I don't know. It just looks so cute and I would like to go there. square away. I can absolutely do that. Let's go back. We're just, we just, this is the level that we're in now. But it does not let me go further this way, which is kind of what I'd seen. There's like a very clear edge of map And I don't see any way to do this here. And so then my question kind of becomes, maybe? Oh, Whoa, hello. Uh, I have some dislike for this, but I am seeing something over here. Can I go off screen? I cannot go off screen here, chat. I think the castles might just be aesthetic. I am not, I am not sure what I'm supposed to do. Oh, I'm gonna get crushed. Again. Love it. I didn't know if he would go through it or not. People are getting wrecked. Oh no! I'm missing a whole bunch of things over this way. Ugh. Okay. 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 This is this is fine. It was not fine. These guys move so slowly, and I still can't keep up with them. I think I have to be down here to get to this part. Ooh, well I definitely want this. Which involves doing a little bit of a something. Uh, 
Yes. Okay. Oh my gosh, yes. Hilarious. See, this one again, the castle just seems to be the aesthetic of this level. Why is the bear crying? How do I fix it? Why is the bear crying? Chat! <gasps> He's broken! No, I need to fix him! The re okay. Right. There. Okay. <gasps> Chat. There is um. Oh my gosh. No, go this way, sir. Um. Just, just destroy the truck, please. This is so hard to do with the screen moving like this. <laughs> oh, okay. I understand. Yeah, I'm gonna miss that. But I wanna get this. Like, most of this is because the screen keeps going back and forth. How, what am I supposed to even do? This is so ridiculous. Okay. <laughs> that was so funny. Six bear steel lollipop. Nope. Nope. Why did that take me three tries? Oh. This game is so cute. I'm glad I get to play it again for, for a little bit. I did not get the CD, and I'm okay with that. Okay, so that looks like a pump. That looks like a piece of cake. Not as in that looking, that looks like a literal piece of cake on a patch. Amazing. So this whole thing really does look like a cake mushroom run? Why would you put mushrooms on cake? That's definitely orange, kiwi, and banana slices. Oh, I see. Actual mushrooms. I... I see. That is a lot less clear. Welcome back, Petulant Cobra! Um, that is... That is an attempt at an entrance. Yeah. I would like this. 
It's an improvement. I want to land on the mushroom. I want to. Oh! Oh! I have done things. 2.5 times better than the exit? That's fair. That's a good way to judge things. Do I like bounce higher if I do. Okay, well. None of that was what I intended to do. That's what I wanted to do. Nope, that is not what I had intended to do either. Pretty sure the bot subs in a D6 in Petulant Cobra rules. The bot just casts Bane on Petulant Cobra exclusively. There we go. That's what I meant to do. Oh my goodness, what a shot. Did I know that was how that worked? No. That dude has electricity, and that is going to hurt me sometimes. Yes. How do I how do I get down there? One one presumes I get down there by going over here. Feeble mind, more like. That's fair, actually. Because Bane is just subtracting D4. And it certainly seems like a much greater disadvantage than that. Oh my goodness. These are the cutest, like. How is this game just, like, the aesthetics in this game are so perfect, you know? Oh, it doesn't even matter that the controls are very slow and awkward. Can I make it? No, I cannot. Sets your charisma to one? Oh my goodness. It is such cozy music, and I enjoy it. How do I get to that upper one? Probably like that. Cool. What is this? That's a good thing to have. Since you're into one, but charisma is more relevant here. Wow! Can you, like, um, do you need, like, a greater restoration or something to fix it? Because that feels awful. I am, I am off cycle here. Oh, cool, I made it. Yeah, treasure. Mushroom lamp! 30 days? Oh gosh, but you're into set to one! That just feels unfair. Hey, remember this thing that we utterly wrecked you for? Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna let you use that to Jeez. Gre greater restoration, heal, or wish can end it early. Right, well, wish can do anything within reason, so that, that definitely makes sense. Huh, okay, so we have blue mushrooms now. What do the blue mushrooms do? Oh, they angle. Which we absolutely need. Oh, that dude is just awful. Okay. What is more this way? 
Oh, these are just self-contained houses. Okay. I like that the snail keeps going forever. There's something at the top of this whole mess. Hello. What is that? This feels so much like it's got to be moving on. Okay. Let's pop into, oops, that is a snail. Is that any healing, or is there actually, like, a spell called that that I'm just not remembering right now? Nice. The spell heal. Okay. There was just a spell I wasn't remembering. So I do think I need to climb to the top of everything again. level one. 70 HP, wow. Have I ever had a character with that level of magic? It is a real question. Oh, hello. I love the little bump I make in the fabric. Well, didn't get everything, but that's fine. Ring the bell, Kirby. Another cute level! All of these levels are so cute. But I want a level with cake. <gasps> Chad, I think I'm gonna get my wish. Oh, I missed the CD. That's fine. I found a cake patch. I would like a level with cake. Where does the cake go? Cake goes here. Cake. Yes. Oh, chat, we are making a cake. It's a piece of cake to make a piece of cake. What? Sweets Park. This looks yummy. I love how the flowers, the dinosaurs, and the cookies are all just different aesthetic skins for the same concept of this will roll when I jump on it. How do I get down there? Is there a secret? Yes. Oh, yeah. Amazing. You gotta do the cooking by the book. I'm glad someone understood the very silly reference that I was making. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'm gonna make this jump chat. Oop! I didn't want to make the jump, apparently. But I did make it. Okay. Are there any secrets down here? There are not. I often, like, double press to do the run, and it takes it as two individual inputs, as opposed to doing what I was told it would do. Yeah! This game is very cruel cool at penalizing you for getting hit. 
I'm usually much better at it, but, you know, life. Um, the Little John mashup of the song is the only reason that I know it, truthfully, uh, because I never watched Lazy Town. It is ridiculous. Uh, not polite. One trip to the hospital and all your money gone. You're right. In that way, Kirby is the most realistic game. Oh, the pudding knocks me down. I see. I see. So we do it like this. I would like these, though. How do I, how do, I do that? It does. It it works way better than it has any right to. I wonder if I can... Yes. Okay, okay. What do I do with this, though? I need, I need to bring something yarny here. Chat. I need to bring something with yarn here. That's not how you do it. Okay. Are you back? Nope. Are you back now? Huh, oh, how far away do I have to go to get the waddle be back? Okay, so that isn't how I do that. Um, how do I do this then? Because I can't... Oh, right. No, I understand. Maybe. I'm actually going this way. Gotcha. Seriously? That was such a good jump! This is fine. How do I get all of this money? That's enough. That's enough of the money. There's no sense in being greedy. In chat. This, for all that this is definitely not Christmas music, has like the most Christmassy vibe of any non Christmas song. You know? No! Don't crush me. I worked too hard to get here. Oh my gosh. That bump is catastrophic. Okay. Cool. New zone. 
yes. Yes, I will collect all of these with great patience. And now there's more down there. Welp, we all know the first place I'm going. Oh, oh, I see. I don't know if there is ground under this, so I really want to not. It's an umbrella, chat. I have one of those. Oh, I assume. Oh, it's a platform that I didn't, I didn't do well enough. Yeah, I am so hungry now. I was a little bit hungry before. I am quite hungered now, chat. See, these ones are hard to get. There's an up, or there's a this way. What is the up? Is the up moving on? It is acting a lot like moving on. <laughs> Garlic Grove, thank you very much for redeeming Dehydrate. How do I do this? Oh, I think I know how to do this. I'm just going to try to get myself onto solid ground first. Which, you know, is going to be a minute. Whew! Thank you very much for eating me dehydrate. I am currently snacking on the uh, cheese bits. Ritz cheese bits. They're very yummy. I'm almost out. I do have chips for when I'm out, but. And by that I mean. I'll probably have lunch today. But when I'm finished with these, I have further dehydrates in the form of chips. Which is delicious. I am such a fan. Cheese bits are really good, chat. If you like cheese and ritzy crackers, these are a very satisfying form. I kind of want to dip them in cheese whiz. That would be yummy. I'm, I'm not a healthy person. <laughs> Thank you very much for redeeming those dehydrates, Garlic Grove. That was lovely. Get me out of here. Oh! That looked like skill. I assure you it was not. I am now less convinced that I'm not supposed to just go up here. What are you? What are you? Oh! actually handle to get to the top of this, but I don't know what that is. Okay, that was fine. Am I able... Oh, I cannot go through the dirt at all. There's something sneaky going on over here. You see that, chat? 
I, I did not do effectively with the dirt what I needed to do. That is maybe fine. I didn't understand what I was doing. Okay, it was effective enough to get the dessert dresser, but not to get whatever that thing in the far end is. That's fine. That really was a very cool soundtrack. Okay, I'll just, I'll be here. Bop. Okay. We are back to the part where we move on. Seriously, but I can't see where the ground is supposed to- Oh, there's a button. That was very nearly not, not enough. This cake looks so good. The backgrounds of this just, oh, I'm so glad I have cupcakes in the fridge. It was enough so that we were never in any real danger, just a small amount of simulated peril. Such vibey music. You did forget to eat cake last night, Kimanzel. I thought about that this morning. I'm sorry I didn't remind you last night because I didn't remember last night. Would you like cake now? Would you like cake after lunch? No, you said lunch after dessert. Why is that? Why is that level of cake made of music? You are so bad at birthdaying. I mean, I think you're great at birthdaying because I think you're great at most things. And if you had a fun birthday, then maybe you're good at birthdaying. Because isn't that what it's all about? But you could say, I am pretty bad at birthdaying because I didn't remind you to eat cake after dinner. I was so wrapped up in just like having some good couch time. Gay Menzel is bad at birthday? Yes! Yes! That's very funny. Well, it could technically mean more cake today, but the point is we've had the cake since Saturday when Kay Menzel specifically was waiting to, until his birthday to eat it and then missed eating it on his birthday. <laughs> and everyone should wish Kay Menzel a happy belated birthday from yesterday because it was his birthday yesterday. And he's here. <gasps> every time I do music things. Chat, every time I do music things. I get little, I get little notes. Happy be late to eat your cake day. I mean, be late to birthday. You are also very truly, Kimenzel, not a desert person. <laughs> okay, fine. You're also not a desert person. Stripper right now. <gasps> yeah. It's a dry. Kimenzel, it's all percussion. Oh my goodness. I get to play the timpani! The cake was a gift. Um, that is the most fun I've ever had out of this had of this game. It it was it was a gift from um, but is mayonnaise an instrument? Yes, the cake is an appreciated gift from my mom, who is a baker and who loves baking things for her children for their birthdays. Is mayonnaise an instrument? Yes. 
Exactly. It's gift cake. And I am a dessert person. <laughs> this is just the best level. Do I go higher? No. This level is so good. Nope. We're gonna die. I did the double tap. I just lost so much money in the most unfair way. I did the double tap to go fast. Like that. And it didn't go fast. And so then my jump missed. But I need this piano. I like that these tones, while not precisely, um, like they're not precisely the same pitch as the background music, but they suit. That's a snare drum, I understand. level is so good. <gasps> Am I gonna get to play harp strings? Yeah. See what I mean? Yeah. That's so cute. The lie is getting the cake in both of those cases. That they're treble clefs, yes, and that they have little tambourine roots, absolutely. There is like an appropriate time for me to play the harp in... Oh my goodness, it's a French horn. I didn't want to skip any of this. Can I go back? Of course it. This one looks like he has a conductor's baton. It's that. It's when the music goes da 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 da. That if you do the harp slide, it is that. Oh, that's so cute. I get a cliff tree! I get to keep one of those! That is the greatest. I was going the wrong way for that, but that's fine. I get to ride the music staff again. This is fine. I like how happy music note Kirby becomes when I get the notes! Unbelievably adorable chat. Oh my goodness, it's an accordion. Oh, I need to do that when the drum is... Yes. Amazing. They did. It really feels as though they did, I mean, I think a fantastic job with the aesthetics of a game like this. Hello? Where did that one go? 
Oh, all the way over there. Okay. Snare drum, snare drum. Symbol, symbol. I would like, I would like to go here, please. Your granddad could play the accordion. Accordion. I d ig ignore my pronunciation. We're f we're fine. Your grandfather could play the accordion. That is a really cool fact. I cannot play the accordion. I can't even pronounce it. following these music notes everywhere because this is so much fun. Wait, where where did that one go? I love it. I love this. Accordion. You can play the piano, you can play half of it. Oh, that involves some quick button pressing. Like, weirdly, suddenly adrenaline. <laughs> if you could play the piano, yes. Accord Eon, the new EV illusion. Where they inevitably make a music type Pokemon, yes. I will get those extra things because that is adorable. Cool! We also get the best reward! Okay, so this is my favorite level hands down of this entire game. <laughs> this is just made of- Melody Town is where I want to land! Okay, Menzel, take notes. I wonder what the real estate market is like there. Just look at how perfect it is. It's so, it's so lovely. I'm really glad we're playing this today because, oh, Kirby's just not in the cutscene. <laughs> this is fine. The music levels in the Rayman game? I have not. Why is that an evil pumpkin? Why is Squashini the boss for Sweets Land? Okay. You make a good point, Fal, because Kirby is the villain and we know that. Nope. Yes. That's what I wanted to do. Big assumption. I know, I know, I know. I just like making that exist. Okay, so there is a bear. And a dessert. Yes. I have the items that I need for this. big assumption of true. Hello! Hi, Carrie! Wait! Hold on! Carrie is the name of one of the pixels in Super Paper Mario, and she does not look like this. This is, this is what Barry looks like. Is Carrie related? Is Carrie Barry's sister? And or brother? Pink is, pink is actually a pretty valid color for any gender and over the whole spectrum. Is, is Carrie the sibling of Barry? Is that why they look alike? Maybe that's why Barry was friends with Carrie in the Pixel universe. Carrie Barry. It's like Mary Barry. Okay, hi. So what do you do? We do, in fact, have to transport Carrie. We need to get Carrie to this spot. Careberry. Okay. I, I'm invested. So I need to get Carrie to the little throne in the palace. And 
back, Carrie. Mm, rude. <laughs> Carrie can't even help us by destroying things. That is quite rude. No. Uh, yes. I do, I do get it. Are you serious? They actually created platforms because you cannot carry anything while going up ladders. What? You yeet! I'm learning so many rules about how this works. Okay, where'd she go? She's here. Come back. Can you say Mary, Mary, and Mary? I, I think so. Did I just do that? Where, where do I go? Here? Is, is here where I go? I don't know where I'm going. Throne! Throne! We did it! Okay, that was actually very funny. Ask me anything. Can you say Mary, Mary, and Mary? Yes, I can. I just did. I did it twice. Mary, Mary, and Mary. Isn't that what backpacks are for? They are. Yeah, some people do say them um, differently or the same. Like, I can... So sometimes when I'm talking to someone, I'll try to stress the difference between Mary and Mary by, like, the shape of my mouth or by, like, the way I hold vowels, but I absolutely say all of those names the same, or all of those words the same. And here's a little secret. I, I, do, I do tend to say them the same. You were bringing her the, to the church possibly to get married? Yes. I do say them the same, and part of the reason that I say them the same is that in case y'all didn't know chat, and this is like a big, huge revelation, my first name is Mary. And so I specifically say them the same so that I can put puns in things like Merry Christmas. So I've like deliberately cultivated for most of my life to try to like say those the same, it feels. I do not say Mario the wrong way. I I know I did. I know I did. I know I did. And I'm sorry, but it's a funny joke no matter what. Exactly. Merry Christmas. I had a friend named Mary who got married. Did you? Shocking. I wonder who that could possibly be. <laughs> and so chat, y'all now know a secret. Mary, Mary just got married. When I was in grade seven, this is again another very much a side story. Um, when I was in grade seven, on the first day of school, we had to introduce ourselves to the class by picking an adjective that started with the same first letter as our name and using that adjective to define us. And then if you went after that person, you had to say their adjective and name and then your own adjective and name. So you had to kind of like it got harder and harder and harder, but the goal was to learn each other's names. And I, from where the teacher started, I was the last person. And so I knew from the beginning I was going to have to remember everybody's adjective and everybody's name. And I got everyone's name and I only missed one adjective the whole route through the class. And when it got to me, I said, and I'm Mary Mary. Because I thought that was funny. And there were absolutely some people who didn't realize that was an adjective. You also still have that friend. Shocking! Amazing! Unlike Kirby, who just ditches people. Yes. Valid. Another favor. He's gonna ask me. Yep. Three floors. Do we have 25,000 beads? On the first day of preschool, my teacher gave to me. That doesn't work for middle school. Fountain Gardens. I want to do it. This is fun. 
I mean, maybe it's fun. I don't really know where I'm going. Get Carrie to that spot. How do I get me to that spot? Okay. That's, that's where I do it. Okay. I wasted a lot of time not remembering how I was supposed to get there. Are you kidding me? You can miss that shot, chat. Will she come with me if I do this? She will not! Okay, I'm gonna fail this. This is fine. What is the arc on my throw? Carrie! <laughs> the failure music is so funny! Yes, I want to try again. I understand how I'm supposed to do it. I just didn't know what my throw arc was. I missed. This one is kind of cute. It's a creative... Oh, that is a throw arc. Carrie, my, my darling. Don't you dare. Oh. Hey. Come on. Oh, my stars. Get me up there. Oh. Man, this is like stressful levels of course. Okay. I thought it would autocorrect a little bit, like the patches, like if I got her near-ish. You have enough beads to expand the apartment building. Thanks, greedy landlord! It's fine. I, I will, actually. Ooh! I would absolutely wear clothes in that tartan. Okay. Oh wow, we absolutely have enough beads. Let's see. Three floors of pure majesty. And I'm expected to furnish the apartments. Of course I am. Isn't it great that I'm just finding all this free furniture uh, by being here? So what goes in apartment 301? No, this guy does not. We pay him because he's our landlord. We paid him for the apartment that we have and then we are also doing this in addition to having paid rent. We are also paying to have the building refurnished and like... It's, it's awful. Hello? Pointing at the screen is an interesting endeavor. So I know I have, wait, I have the outdoor bath as well. Don't know if I recognize either of these shapes, but I have the torch. So that was one of the shapes that I missed? No, that's an hourglass. This looks kind of like a cupcake to me and that looks like a totem pole with ears. Totem pole with ears. Cupcake. Gotcha. Okay, so we do not have what we need.
gosh. So many of these games are just a lot of fun. Nintendo makes good games sometimes, chat. Okay, so this is the Treblecraft Tree, an alien TV. So I have the Treblecraft Tree. I don't think I have anything else yet. Because I don't think the mushroom bed is this. I think this is something else in the, like, alien TV. Okay. Okay. So we're still missing some stuff. That's okay. Does Carrie have more fun for us? I know there's a Z hide and seek that I haven't done. There's so much like extra content. Okay, so flower fields. What is the flower fields one? Ooh. I spilled my tea. So I need to get her to the top of the rainy bit. Did, did she... Okay. Stay there, my dear. Lady QEW spilling tea in the morning. I did, in fact, do that. Both literally and figuratively. Spilling tea in the morning. That one was cute. I like the creativity. What is the tea? Do you mean literally or figuratively? I like the creativity in these little mini games. The fact that they like use different. Yes. So the literal tea is uh, a David's tea from their advent calendar, uh, which is a salted caramel oolong, and it is super delicious. And the figurative tea was, I told you guys my name. Yum. Fairy soda fabric. I mean, I also was sassy about landlords. It is some big tea. Oh no. Lava? Well, let's try it. All I can do is fail or succeed. One of those two. Those are my options. Get to that spot. I don't remember where that is. <laughs> I can't believe she has a name you would have you would think she would have told me earlier. Okay, Mental. How innocent you are. Oh no! Oh! Oh! I actually, like, need these guys to exist. Um, nope. Okay. I've, I've had, I've had less success. I don't, I don't want to hurt Carrie. She is an exaggerator. This is fine. Thank you, girl. Oh my gosh. Can I, like, throw her this way? Okay, she gets hurt when I do, but that's, that's fine. Good enough. Yes, okay. Hello? Carrie. My darling. Yes, okay, fine. It takes too long to do it that way. Where am I supposed to throw her so that she's safe and I can pick her up again? I 
and, and and was that ever a good thing? I think I'm confused and missing context. I think I was close. See, that makes sense. I didn't know that. Oops! Nope, dead. How rude! You put me back there? Oh my gosh, Carrie. Girl! Girl! Friend! This is such a waste of time! So it's these volcanoes that I need to figure out the most. Because it takes a long time. Like, she just... Her throw arc is very difficult. I, so if I throw her see even that still hit see what I mean like I don't think I'm gonna succeed with this one it's fine we'll, we'll try it again um like I could definitely save a lot of time by actually not sucking for the first half of this but for the second half of this with the volcanoes I'm like what is the throw arc to have her land safely and not hit them because you have to throw before you can even see them. I can, I think, throw straight up. That might be the play. That That's a reasonable play. Apparently that's a compliment? That's a weird compliment. Wow. Carrie, honey, you are testing our friendship right now. I will tell you what. That's okay. I think I have another hide and seek, so I might do that to finish up today. Yes! Toy tracks! You have to find people! I mean, that definition is a choice. Oh my gosh. I can't let go. <laughs> that was such a waste of time. Okay, so I see one up there. Which makes sense. How many times am I going to have to hit that before he actually goes quick? Oop. Gotcha. Probably one up here. There is not. There's one behind this. Really? So this is the end of where we can go. I missed- oh! He's right there. <laughs> the curl looked so natural I almost didn't notice. A very UK use of that word. Yeah! You know what? That's fair. Another hide and seek stage will Zeke. I'm sorry, you're gonna have to wait. Oh, that was fun. That was cute. Thanks, chat, for voting for this one today. Thanks for voting for me Pokemon Snap on Monday. Honestly, I have a lot of fun playing all of these games, so that was nice to chill and have, like, the chillest vibe of musics. These are, these are some great musics. 
Um, so fun times, uh, in the chaos of my work life and work schedule right now, chat, um, I still don't have my work schedule for next week yet. So what I can tell you is it looks like I'm probably not going to be streaming Monday. Um, but in terms of when I will be streaming, I'm going to have to let y'all know when I know. So, you know, if you're subbed, maybe drop into that Discord, and if not, maybe give it a follow or turn notifications on so that you know when I start next time, because <laughs> solidly, I don't even know. But I will try to figure it out. Um, I'm supposed to be getting a message today uh, from my manager to tell me what my schedule is for next week. <sighs> I'm supposed to be. So we'll see. I will do my best to get that information available to you guys as soon as I have it. Um, but in the meantime, I'm going to be done for the week. And we're going to go on a little bit of a raid. And let's see. Who have we got? Ooh. All of these are good choices. Watch me just raid Critter Vision one day. Thank you for being here, Kate. And thank you, everybody, for stopping in, for voting, for having a chat, just for having fun with me, because I really enjoy it. And it's nice to celebrate the holidays of December with y'all. Oh. Have you already played it, Kate? Or are you playing it later? I'm just trying to decide which person I'm... What time are you streaming? Later today? Okay. Okay, so I'm a little bit early. Okay, 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 okay. Well, I will probably absolutely watch the VOD, but I might... We'll have to see. I have some stuff I need to do this afternoon, but I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to show up. I'm gonna try. I'll do my best, but thank you for letting me know because that's such a good game and I would love to see you experiencing it. I think, um, so there's a couple of people right now who are playing Pokemon Scarlet Violet, which is what I would like to pop over to because it's a new game and it's exciting, but it looks like one of them is at the Pokemon League and I don't really want to see that yet. So. We're going to raid Focus on Me Play, who is a lovely streamer. Do, 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 do. And we're going to see um, where she's at with that game. So there's a raid message. Anybody who uh, wants to pick that up and drop that, uh, I would I would appreciate I would appreciate y'all being sweet and polite and all sorts of other things, but mostly sweet and polite. Um, continued happy holidays for those who are making their way through December. I had a great time. Um, I will see y'all next week. Not sure when yet. Um, but in the meantime, have a wonderful day.